yesterday evening, just before nine o'clock, 8.59 to be exact, we received a phone call from a gentleman in our community here in Reading to say he found a young child, a baby we believe to be two to three weeks old, a young girl, uh, in on the doorstep of his home address in the London Road in Reading. The little girl was in a holdall. Um, the baby was taken to Royal Berkshire Hospital where she stayed overnight. She was in warm clothing in the bag and was wearing a nappy. Early indications when we arrived at the scene there were that the baby didn't appear to be in any difficulty, didn't appear to be injured in any way or didn't appear to have come to any harm. A priest who lives at an address on London Road uh, returning from the Royal Barch Hospital at about 9pm last night um, after visiting a friend. Uh, when he came to the uh, front door of his house he saw a black hodl and inside that hodl he found uh, the child. And what are the police doing now to find the mother of the child? At the moment we, we have some idea on the baby's first name and also the child's rough date of birth. Uh, we are working with the NHS and social care both within this area and the surrounding areas to see if we can locate a child that was born around that particular time. Uh, we're also making numerous inquiries within the Polish community uh, and also making extensive CCTV inquiries to see if we can identify mum. Uh, but I must stress that our main concern at the moment here is the welfare of mum. Um, because we, we need to know that she is okay and she, has, and she doesn't have any, any issues that uh, could concern us. I believe the note with the baby indicated uh, the mum's state of mind and what she felt. Can you tell us something about what that Yes, meant? yes, it basically, it basically made reference to the fact that she feels unable to look after her, um, but she did want, uh, they, they, there was um, an item in the bag that she wanted the child to have when the child was older uh, um, because it was uh, something that was uh, important to her to, to, to give to the child. Can we so ask what the item was? Not, not at this time, no, okay. we, we might release that another, another time. Okay, and I understand the baby was in, uh, healthy um, and well. Yeah, baby is baby's fit and well. Um, I've actually visited her um, and she's been very well cared for and will be released shortly. Uh, the baby will be handed, uh, as I understand it, Jill, from the uh, National Health Service at the hospital uh, sometime this afternoon into the care of social services under Reading Borough Council. They've already identified foster carers for the child uh, and the child will remain with foster carers uh, whilst the investigation continues in order to try and trace mum. Obviously we'd like to get a message out to the mother to say regardless of where she delivered the baby, um, we are very keen to offer her um, advice and support that she may need and to encourage her to come forward and to reassure her that you know, her baby is um, being well cared for but um, we would like to reunite them if possible. We've created a flyer which I've handed out to you, which we'll be handing out in our local communities, including the Polish community, asking for any witnesses, anybody with any information, however insignificant they might see that, might just help us uh, as we try and locate the whereabouts of the mother and try, try and identify it so that we can then uh, put the wheels in motion in terms of our own welfare. So our investigation here from Thames Valley Police is centred very much on locating mum and ensuring that she's safe and well.